Last time Bradley came in here was with that uh, that war with the uh, Ruslan Provednikov, and we expect the same sort of thing tonight. Here we oh. go. Uh, HBO in the United States, which is a big deal. You people have had the opportunity to see him at Watch Our World telecast. As a matter of fact, Jesse, but Jesse, Jesse, you know, he doesn't have that sort of demeanor that he's going to be intimidated by him. A little bit more aggressive, and I think he's landed more punches. Nice right yep. hand right at the belt. I mean, he's got 26 victories and only nine knockouts, so he's not a big knockout puncher. He caught Tim with a decent left hook that time, though. Jesse not getting our first as much as Timothy is. Uh, Timothy's throwing combinations. There he is again. Uh, that's exactly what Tim wants to do is keep pressure on this guy constantly. Oh! Look at this! And, oh, that was on the shoulder, actually. He threw that punch so hard. Right. And we've got Timothy Bradley in the blue against Jesse Vargas in a very close fight after three rounds. Ooh. And Bradley just landing. That can be dangerous. Bradley sets oh. up right in front of him. Loads up the right hand. Uh, Timothy Bradley's hand speed is... It's, oh! And it, nice. it's, it's really showing in it. It looked in that combination of punches there considerably fast. Oh, right at the belly, clips Vargas again. We're both on the same page, oh, but we got there different ways. Uh, yeah, 39 to, yeah, right, 37 actually. Two, I had all by two. And that was the Manny Pacquiao, but he also has a win over Manny. Oh, oh look at this, up and down. Tim Bradley to the body back upstairs. Jesse's seeing things I don't think he's seen before in his career from Tim Bradley. Yeah. He's going to have to mix it up with Bradley. He's going to have to put his ears back and, and just go ahead and mix it up with Tim. Boy, Bradley's just really assaulting him. Closing <sighs> seconds now of the fifth. He catches him pretty good. Look at this. Wow. How about that? He has a mid but he's just on top of him. But... Here's what Jesse has to do. He decides to come back. He lands a good right hand right there. And Jesse's last few fights, other than the DeMarco fight, you know, those are real close decisions, too, that, that he happened to pull out. He wants Bradley to be smart and to box. I think that if he knows that he's ahead and is going to try to protect a lead, that maybe he'll be smarter. I bet Russell tells him so. No smile on the face of Vargas in this round either in round yeah. nine. Well, he's just taking him apart right now. Oh, oh another nice. liver shot that time. He's trying to counter a little bit, but he hasn't gone inside to try to, you know, beat him up oh. inside. Almost That's cut him flush right on hand. the jaw with the right hand. That's right, he's not. He, I mean, he should be, there's a, gotta be a, oh! He cut Tim! Tim almost went down. There's an urgency now with 16 seconds to go. Tim got clipped. That's the first time that anyone's been close to going down. Closing seconds of the fight. And like the Provednikov fight. What? No. Something. What happened at the end? Oh. No, it was 10 seconds and he thought he, that fight was over. Watch this. And he gets oh, nailed yeah, right on the right. chin. And he's almost ready to go. Yep. And here's the sense of urgency. But he's got an amazing ability to recover and survive. And here's the very end now. Now Pat thinks that he heard the bell. That's right, he's not. He, I mean, he should be, there's got to be a... Oh! He cut Tim! Tim almost went down! There's an urgency now with 16 seconds to go! Tim got clipped! That's the first time that anyone's been close to going down. Closing seconds of the fight. And like the Provednikov fight. What? No. Something. What happened at the end? Oh. No, it was 10 seconds and he thought he, that fight was over. Interim WBO welterweight world champion. Desert Storm. Timothy.